Hey, that's Mike and Holly, Alex, Eddie, and Kelsey. Hopefully, today, kind of hopefully, bittersweet, hopefully today is the day that Michael gets his tooth pulled. We're on our way to the oral surgeon. Okay, guys, we just dropped off Michael. Um, <laughs> he's probably going to be here for a little while. And so Chelsea and I are going to go find something to do. I have found on my map thing a Salvation Army close by. And you know we love thrift shopping. So we're going to go check it out. I think this is one I've been to before and it was really good. Like I found a lot of really good stuff. So we're just, I felt funny about leaving him because I'm like, I don't want to leave. Like what if you, what if you need me? What if something happens? He's like, what are you going to do? <laughs> well, no, it's a panic freak out. <laughs> So anyway, um, I guess just kind of take our mind off of it or whatever. He's the one going through it, but I have like the anxiety over it as well. It's really interesting how they put all the toys up on top shelves. This guy's, oh my gosh, he's solid. Because you would think, yeah, giant giraffe. You would think that they would have toys down low where kids could be like, mom, I want that. <laughs> but they're all up high, so she has a hard time seeing them, which is fine by me. I but keep looking because I found this little dog. Wait, can I take him and think about flying? You can think about it. You gotta get rid of something at home. If you get something new, you gotta get rid of something at home. Look at this, it's a Chia Pet poop emoji. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's so funny. I don't think I've seen that one before. Have you? Have you seen that before? That's pretty funny, isn't it? Chelsea's found a puppy that she's got to decide about getting rid of something at home. No. Mm hmm To show just the sheer size of this. Mug. It's a planter. It's like a coffee mug. <laughs> Mikey after dentist. <laughs> <laughs> you look a little pale. Oh, well, sure I am. Oh, man. How'd it go? Are you ready to talk about it or is it too soon? <laughs> so I end up, first. I've had a tooth pulled before and I wasn't, I didn't get anything like just the numbing when they pulled it. Yeah. And I didn't feel pain, but I had felt pressure. And then we just went to the dentist and she tried numbing it and couldn't numb it. So I'm a little worried this time. So I like, just give me either the gas or knock me out. He said, you know, we can start with gas. The gas should work. And because I was taking antibiotics that the pain had gone away. So gave me the gas, didn't feel a thing. I was out. Like I had no clue it was done. Were you sleeping? Oh, I was like out. Like there was <laughs> like the last thing I remember, he started to drill a little bit and that was it until I woke up. Huh? Nothing, like not a single thing. Didn't it, feel it. No. Don't, nice don't even remember it. Don't. No. Last thing I remember was the drill. That was it. And then waking up. <laughs> I'm like, that's, that's so, nothing. Felt wow. like I, I, I could have been dead because it was <laughs> nothing. He had a nice little cat nap then. Yeah, like, <laughs> like it's weird because like he, they gave me the gas to start with. And I like started, I really drifted and was gone. And then came back and thought, oh, wow, it's done. And it was just the shot to, like, to numb it that he gave me. Oh. Like, and I was kind of out of it. So I'm like, I, like, I'm feeling there. It's still there. It's still there. It's not done yet. Oh, no. <laughs> and he comes back in and then they start doing it. And I guess they turned the gas off, turned it back on. And then the last thing I felt was a little bit of drilling and then out until I woke up. So Michael texted me and Chelsea and I had just finished shopping and we were like, we were ready to come get you, which it was perfect timing. But he texts me something like, come get me or whatever. And I said, is it done? And you were like, I don't know. Right. Because I had woke up that first time thinking, wow, he's done. And it wasn't all he had done so far was just numb it. Did you text, so they must have turned the text, gas on. But did you text me then? And but they weren't done. No. You know. So they must have <laughs> turned the gas on, and really got me going to give me the shot, and then turned the gas back off. And then I kind of woke up, thinking, "Oh, it's done," 
and then I felt with my tongue. No, the tooth's still there. Right, but was that when you texted no. me or you tell? Oh. So then he came back in, <laughs> did the gas thing, started drilling, and I was out. And then I woke up again, and that's when I texted you because I wasn't sure. You know, okay, did did they turn the <laughs> gas off again? And I woke up, and it's still actually not done. So I texted him back, and I said, "Did they pull it?" And he said, "I don't know." Yeah, I don't know because like <laughs> the first time I thought, "Oh, they're done." No, it's still in there. All they had done was numb. numb. Yeah, but it was so funny because sure. he like texted me that he was ready for me to come get him, and I'm like, "Well, did they pull it?" Because it really wasn't that long. He wasn't here that long, no, and all. and I thought it was going to be a bit longer. Like he was going to have to wait longer, and he's like, "I don't know," and I'm like, and then, uh, "Okay." <laughs> well, like I, I kind of once I start to get a little bit sharper, I realized there's the gauze in my mouth. So oh, I figured so if there's gauze to. in my mouth, <laughs> right where it's at. They had to finish it. I must be done then. And then yeah. they came back in and said, "Yeah, it was done." Like I had to ask him twice, "Are you sure it's done?" <laughs> uh, are you sure? Are you yeah. sure I drifted off? I don't well, remember yeah, anything. Well, because yeah, the first time it was a fake drift off the first time. Like I'm, I woke up and I'm thinking, "Oh, it was done." No, they just did give me a shot, and that was it. Oh my gosh! And then when I got here, I was, I said to the girl in the front, "I was like, is, you know, I'm here to pick him up," and she's like, "Oh yeah, okay, he's, they're going over." Um, I said, "Oh, can I go ahead and pay?" Because. I didn't want him to come out and then have to try to pay. I was like, let me just take care of everything for him so that we can just go when he comes out. And she's like, they're going over how to care for it and all of that with him. And then he'll be out in a minute. And I'm like, okay. And so Chelsea and I sit down in the waiting room and he texts me, are you here? <laughs> Yeah, I'm waiting on you to come yeah, I, out. Like, you never, I texted you. <laughs> I, yeah, I, when I think it's done and you never texted back. Well, because I was there, and they were just like, oh, yeah, he'll be out in a minute. So I'm like, okay. So I'm, I'm in there <laughs> hanging out waiting for you to come back from shopping. Which we were already there. Because I didn't want to go sit in the waiting room. I was comfortable in the chair. See, so and I I, when Chelsea and I pulled in, I was like, he's going to either be waiting outside, which I didn't know if they would let him like leave if somebody wasn't there to collect him. <laughs> And when we got here, he wasn't outside. So we went ahead and went in. I was thinking, I like peeked and thought, oh, he's going to be in the waiting room waiting. Nope. So, and then she said that they were going over like how to care for it. That was like 30 seconds. <laughs> I wanted to show you guys really quick what I got at Salvation Army. All their prices, I found a lot of good stuff, but all their prices were kind of crazy. This is a wooden, it's called a wood quilts by uniquely jewel and it's got a number on there um i even went back and looked to see if i could find another one because i liked it so much and when i went to check out the ladies were like wow that's really pretty like everybody was having a fit over it it's even signed right there too michael got motrin <laughs> i popped into meyer and got him Motrin because we didn't have, we have Tylenol in the house, but we didn't have Motrin and they told him to take this for like selling and stuff. We came home and he's like, I don't know what to do with myself. <laughs> I'm usually always busy doing something or other. And... and he's like, I said, well, go take a nap, go lay down, go rest. And he's like, I'm not tired. I got a no, great I, little yeah, cat nap. <laughs> I feel well rested now. So that nitrous that they gave you, man, must have that really good. calmed you down and gave you a good little rest. And now he's like, I don't know what to do now. Yeah, like, like I'm totally, I'm, my mouth Swollen. feels all weird. Not, there's a little bit of pain, so I don't know what to do. <laughs> Just relax. Take it easy. I don't like relaxing. I like doing. I know. I'm the same way. I like to keep busy. <laughs> Sam, I thought you could be trusted out of your crate when we weren't home. You've been doing so she can't well. Can't be trusted when we're home. <laughs> no, she has. She's been so good. And when we leave to go anywhere, even just for a little bit, we wouldn't let her out. Like stay out for hours and hours and hours. But um, well, usually for like up to four hours, maybe. But just now, I discovered this on the landing. Daddy's sock. Oh no. What did you do while we were gone, Pixie? She must have gone in, got the sock, and then went down to the landing. <laughs> no, she's been so good. Usually when we leave, she'll just lay on the landing and wait for us to get home. But today you went exploring, got yourself a sock first, huh? 
Dinner is served. <laughs> there's not a whole lot that Michael can eat because of his tooth. Oh, there's a hair on the lens. Um, so, and he's like, well, what do you guys want to eat? And I'm like, I really don't care because I never really care. And Chelsea earlier mentioned McDonald's. Well, I'm not a huge fan of McDonald's, but Michael was like, well, their fries do sound good. And oh, since- Last time I had McDonald's fries. Yeah, since they'll be like soft for him to eat, yeah. um, I went and got him fries. Chelsea got a Happy Meal and uh, I went to Taco Bell. <laughs> Yeah, I had been thinking about Taco Bell for a few days, and so I was like, oh, I'm just gonna go to Taco Bell. I don't want McDonald's. <laughs> okay, update on Toothless. <laughs> toothless Joe. <laughs> I have to say, like, I was pretty anxious to get my tooth pulled, because I remember getting this one pulled. You were not looking forward to it. No, I was not. I remember getting that one pulled, and I remember afterwards some pain, and during there wasn't pain, but boy, I mean, I was awake that time and there was a lot of pressure force. Like they had a hard time getting it out. Like the first tooth that I had moved. So no, I was not looking forward to today. Uh, and like, it is, it's been like perfect. Like I'm in no pain whatsoever. I, knock, knock on wood and. <laughs> okay, well I take that back. Like a couple things. If you're watching the video in the car, you got pain. Yeah. <laughs> if you're watching the part when we were talking in the car, you could see it on my nose, like oh, from the mask. Pump. The wor almost the worst part of that was the gas mask resting oh, on your nose. Like the bridge of my nose is so sore from like when they had that on there. It's not now, but like that it must have been on there really tight or something. And they wanted to make sure so, like, it all got was, in your nostrils. That was the worst part. Was the bridge of my <laughs> nose from the mask. Yeah. Like no pain, felt nothing during it. I'm in no pain whatsoever. Because for, you had the nitrous gas. Yeah. My jaw is sore. Like he may be from where they gave me the shot or something or from biting down on the gauze or something. So my jaw is a little sore, like even on both sides. Yeah. The tooth part, nothing. Like in that area, no pain whatsoever. <laughs> it's like, I'm like so happy because I was pretty worried. Yeah. Like, even afterwards, like, yeah, I'm on the Motrin, but like, I was yeah, we painkillers last last time I got it pulled, and I still had pain. I stopped and got Michael Motrin on the way home, and he has some medicine from the dentist from before that he was supposed to take. So like last week, yeah, last week she said because if if I had infection, well, if right? I had any discomfort because she oh. really got in there with shots and like she was trying her yeah. best. So to my do it. my my gums were sore and stuff last week just because she did so much, but. Boy, that was, I'm just like, <laughs> that was the best. <laughs> Getting my tooth pulled was pretty cool. Like, <laughs> there, there was no pain at all. And now you don't have to deal with worrying about Other it pain, anymore. Yeah. It's, it's done. It's not missing a tooth, but. Yeah, and. Again, this, it's given me issues for a number of years. It's just now it finally got really bad. Right. And I did talk to one other person that had a root canal that said it fell, fell out like this person's my age and it, it just fell out. So yeah. every single person that I personally have talked to that has had a root canal said it ended up falling out anyway. So it was just kind of like, why go through all of that? Could you imagine how sore you'd be if you would have went the know. root canal route? Oh, I thought I was going to be sore this time. Well, and I'm not, so. Yeah, I think it's a lot more detailed. So anyway, he's, he was a champ, <laughs> kind of bored today. Yeah, I mean, there was, like, oh, well, was really nothing. Just kind of took the day to like relax and feel, get rested and feel better. And it was kind of not needed. So yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I think <laughs> the biggest pain for you was just trying to figure out what to eat. Yeah. And even so, like, like I start eating stuff, like, I mean, I can't, can't eat major stuff, but like I started eating stuff and I mean, I, I could chew on my other side. So. I haven't had yeah. the little bit I've eaten. I haven't had any issues. And you don't have gauze in your mouth anymore. No. And like the numbness is all gone. So like I'm not going to accidentally bite down on the tongue or. Yeah. So. So good job. Gold star. <laughs> <laughs>